Welcome back to Pathologic 2. As a YouTuber, I shouldn't really be playing this game right now in the sense that, you know, I try to play a roughly equal amount of whatever games I have running on my channel so that I don't end up with a huge amount of episodes of one and nothing of the other. But I have to admit, Sunless Skies is taking a backseat to this because the draw of Pathologic 2 for me is so unbelievably strong because there's never a dull moment. There's only unending stress. And it's kind of weird that I would want to enter back into this world where everything is so extremely stressful, but it's so engaging. I can't help but feel like, God, I just want to get back into the pathologic world. I need to get some smouter. Maybe I can find some bandages along the way and I need to help all these people so they don't get sick and they don't die and this and that and that. And like, I just, there's so much stuff like I need to do and I need to pack it all in today before the opportunity disappears. So, here I am, playing Pathologic, <laughs> almost at 10 p.m., because I just have to. So, time-wise, it's about noon on day 8. I don't have many markers on the map, but the ones that I do have are kind of big. Biggest are I need to go to the hospital, see what my rounds are for today. That's important. The fund has been absolutely saving my ass. So that's really vital. <clears throat> and the other big thing is we need to fight our way into the termitary to talk with Tai Cheek and figure out what's going on in there because it seems like it's vital. Absolutely vital. But Overseer Oyun said that they got shot with a rifle trying to get in. So if that's what they mean by fighting my way in, dealing with being shot, I'm in a pretty bad point for that because I don't have any guns and a single bullet or punch or really anything would kill me because my health is terrible. I actually just slept in Lara's bed, if you remember that's what we did in the last episode. Managed to barely drag myself to the bed with like nothing showing on my health bar. Slept for a good amount of time, which is why my exhaustion is basically nothing. It got my health bar up to maybe half, but my infection was super high so I took a couple antibiotics and that's why my health is crap again. But at least it won't go down too fast. We don't have to worry about hunger or exhaustion, so that's good. I got two fresh fish on me. Hunger's not even high. It's just health. So, I think where I want to go right now is to the theater to figure out what we need to do for our daily rounds. And I also desperately need to... I need health, probably most importantly, but also just self-defense stuff. So, you know, clothing, armor, a gun would be super nice. The chance of me getting all of those things today and having time to go over here is like basically zero. But I'm going to stop at every pharmacy I can find. I'll trade water bottles for bandages. And dear God, if I can find a schmouter, I will trade you my organs for that. Let's go, I guess. Who do I need to help out, by the way? You need, uh, you need some help. I've got four people infected. Jesus Christ. Right? One, two, three, four. Yeah. Yep, Katarina, Stamaton, Anna Angel, low priority. And the other Stamaton. Uh, yeah, let's just go to the theater. There's no pharmacies along the way, but there's one in the back. I don't remember which pharmacies I've already tried to visit today to find bandages. I know I've visited some and they none of them have had bandages, I don't think. Let's go. We've already treated Laura here, by the way. She's infected. I gotta watch out for people that are gonna kill me. It's not nighttime, so it shouldn't be too bad, but still, one hit and I'm dead. Let's go up here. How's my knife looking? Eh, it's in pretty good condition. How much money do I have? 3,000. I don't think that could buy me a gun. 3,000 was like the really good deal that I could have paid for a pistol back anywhere between day one, two, or three. That was like the discount. It was 3,000. Ooh, big fight going on over there. That might be good for me, actually. Or maybe it'll just kill me. I don't know. There he is. 
Okay, I should loot the body before they loot it, by the way. Calm down. <clears throat> Poke. Now I have a lockpick to trade. I could get an immunity booster. How's my immunity? Could be higher. Does a lockpick have any practical purpose for me right now? No. Oh god. Holy shit, that was close. Man, my immunity is going down so fast in here. If you just look at my immunity bar, it's bad. Maybe I should just like go in here and just try to loot a place. Shall I do that again? Hey, at least I can actually see stuff. That's nice. Oh, 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 oh. Nope. Sorry. Damn, rifle ammo. This is good stuff, actually. This is really good stuff. Oh, God. Fuck. Fuck. Oh, oh, oh. My immunity is basically gone. Hmm. I don't want to use my plus ones if I don't have to. Uh, Zirk? Zirk does... It raises my thirst. That's fine. That's benign. Yeah, totally fine. Shrink. I don't know. Th three of those, I guess? And some water. Alright. I don't know if I want to bother to pick a lock. God, it's so lucrative to go into these infected houses. Holy shit. I'm so sorry, infected. But... i kind of desperate for stuff. Oh my god. No, no, no. Oh. Immunity is basically gone. Mm. I don't want to use the, my last of this tincture. Should I use one of my plus ones? I'll use the Yas Plus. Fuck. Fuck. Yeah, my immunity just... I, I gotta go. I gotta go. My immunity just goes down so fast. I have, like, literally no protection on me at all. <laughs> Jeez. Let's see if I can even survive to the theater. But man, if you have good protection, you have extra stuff to give yourself immunity, that is so lucrative. I need to take something else. I hope whatever my task for today is, it doesn't include treating people. Okay, that was bad. Well, there goes all my immunity. Again. What are you doing here? What's going on here? What are my rounds for today? The rabble believes Simon was reborn as that strange girl. What madman. Only yesterday they despised her. It all failed. The isolation ward in the cathedral, the hospital in the theater. Even the cemetery is an issue now. 
What do you think it failed? Was there a single person who left this hospital healthy? No, but at least we study the disease. A town is dying, and how this Inquisitor. The powers that be know everything. They won't be lenient anymore. Yeah? What can they do? Send the army? The army. No, I don't suppose they would do that. What's the point? It would just be a waste of soldiers. Keep in mind, it's not really a spoiler that the army definitely does come to town, because at the beginning of the game, we kind of started at the end of the game on day 12. And we came to a huge table that had, I believe it was General Block on one side, and Aglaia on the other. Cheer up, we found the cure already. Have we really? Victory's at hand. Hey, Gubar, the doctor's here. Our shift's over. Who are you? Grigory Gorky, orderly number six. Even number, unfortunately. My partner, Averly Gubar, is luckier. How so? It's because suffering tears the soul in two, and death keeps an eye on such moments. <laughs> but that's all just poetry. What I'm saying is, where there's an even number, someone dies. Even numbers are just unlucky. Okay. What's today's job? To check this exact theory. But you ain't danger, Doctor, because you're the one and only, and death avoids ones. It's afraid to prick its fingers on them. All in all, you just gotta wait here for an hour until you're relieved. An hour? Uh... I guess I can do that. An hour? Got enough medicine? Any protective clothing? Even a piece of cloth would do. The air here is thick. Breathing it is like eating infection with a spoon. A really big one. I can tell them, wait a bit, I'll resupply and come back here. Um, are they saying that I'm just going, like, I mean, before I talked to them, my immunity wasn't going down while I'm inside. Is it going to start? I have everything I need. I just need to get this done. Good. We won't lock the door out of respect. Resolve was only heroic as long as there was a choice. But Dr. Bura is not the type to run away, are you? Watch your tone. Wait for an hour until you're relieved of duty. Oh, oh, there's nasty stuff in here. I don't su- Oh, fuck. Oh my god. That just increased my infection so much that I am now dead. And there's nothing in here. Great. There's no way with that much infection I can survive when I have a sliver of health. I can't take antibiotics because it would kill me, wouldn't it? Let me test something. Hmm. I feel like antibiotics hurt me less when my health is low. So, you know, eat them all, I have a sliver of health, but my infection's low. Eat some fish, that'll be my last meal. Am I safe back here? No. No, I'm not. It's chasing me slowly. Reminds me of that movie. What was it called? It Follows? That horror movie? What just happened? 20 minutes have passed. Oh, God. Oh, 
No. Fuck. It's over. I don't know whether it's appropriate to just take my death or just load a save game. Is it cheap to load my save game? I guess it would be. <laughs> Fucking things just come out of come up out of nowhere. They're coming up out of the corpses. Oh, I just realized I'm trapped in here, aren't I? I can't get past that thing. Yep, there we go. Infection killed me. I don't think I can go to the theater first before I kind of get myself more fixed. Yes. Well, if you're a surgeon, your sense of touch must be very keen. What is this item? What is it about? What's its point? It's warm, slippery, quite heavy, smells of dampness and blood. What is it? A liver. You know things by touch. You can feel their attributes, clear enough to not confuse a precious item with trash. If you do, you'll spoil the end. Trash, such as... Such as a surgeon who can't tell a liver or a heart from wool. That trash. Such a person would turn our play into a puppet show for sick children. Well, what does it mean? Or once existed living tissue, you'll now find death. You don't believe me, though. You think I'm just trying to scare you, that it's all make-believe to me. You've hinted at that more than once. I don't hint. I'll tell you outright that I don't believe you. What does this mean, though? Where once existed living tissue, you'll now find death. What does that mean? Whatever it is, it's not good. I have a new idea. I'm not going to the theater, the hospital. I want to chug a bunch of antibiotics to get my infection real low, but that's going to take my tank my health to almost nothing. It does seem like it hurts your health less the lower your health is. I'm pretty confident it could still kill you. But, yeah, I'm pretty sure I could take all of these antibiotics and I'd still be alive. I'd just have extremely little health. Let's not do that. Um, what I'm going to do is actually just stay with my current level of infection and a little bit of hit points so that I can take a couple hits and I mean I'm desperate for just stuff so I'm gonna see if I can find a place that has enemies inside of it not an infected zone because that just really fucks me up just this post infected zone see if I can find looters in any of these buildings yeah yeah, here we go. <clears throat> I'm not confident, if you can tell. Where should I work towards? Oh, right. I think I need to give um, some immunity boosters, not just to Yulia, but I, I didn't buy the map for today. So this actually, this data isn't accurate, is it? Ex unless I've actually been in the spot. So, like, this is accurate here, but I think this place is also infected in this, so... I have the Olgimskis here, and then, well, also an Olgimski, young Vlad, so those three people also need boosters. Maybe I'll just head down that direction, I guess? Sure. And yeah, along the way, see if I can go into any of these buildings. <laughs> Ooh, I can just enter that one. You know what that means. Let me wait for my stamina to come back. Hello. 
Calm down. <clears throat> So much stuff. Can I drop anything that's just like garbage? I mean, like I don't need the chisel. I could eat one of the fish, but that wouldn't clear up any room. A mysterious note I still need to put somewhere. Pick this lock? Yeah, sure. Community boosters. It's nice. I'm gonna leave the rotten food. No thanks. <gasps> Repellent cloak. Oh my god, that is huge. That is so huge. Yeah, I could use that to upgrade my inventory, but honestly, right now, I think it's better just on me. Fucking hell. God knows I need some clothes. <laughs> let's take an immunity booster. Oh hell, let's take two. I don't know if having your immunity higher makes the infection do less damage to you. I doubt it. I don't think that's how that works. This might break it. <laughs> yep. Alright, it's alright. Got another one. Such a big thing and so little in it. on the ground. It's just a basic cloak. I don't know if it's worth taking. It's huge. How many pieces is it? It's it's three by three. Hmm. Well, I'll take it for now, but drop it if I need to. Let's eat a fish. Uh, I can't eat the other fish without it being a waste. Can I even get 3x3 three three then? Should be able to just by rearranging some stuff, yeah. It's pretty good durability too. All locked. Good stuff, maybe? Can't hold the chisel, that's fine. Cloth gloves? Okay, that's fantastic. I found so many nuts and stuff. It's gonna be great for trading with the kids. How am I doing on time? Hasn't been that much time. My health is rapidly deteriorating, but my protective clothing is rapidly increasing. Stone would actually be really nice. I definitely don't have the room for it right now, though. I don't know how much the cloak is going to be worth. Probably a decent amount. It's just huge. And I honestly could really use the grindstone. Uh, but you know what? Then again, like, I don't need black twire. Or blood twire. Watch, I'll encounter an enemy and they'll kill me. Is 
bloody bandage. I probably should toss that. I will if I need the space. Wish I'd found a gun, but this is a lot of good stuff. I should probably just leave at this point. Did I loot this? No. I don't want them for that. I'll just leave that. Unless, hold on, hold on. What's the durability? It's max. This thing is far from max. Let's drop this. Glad I checked. Oh. Let's drop it in a different place so I don't confuse them. It put them into the same thing anyway. Whatever. Yeah, fuck off. Okay. So, let me take a look at what I have. Cloak, that's definitely for selling. My health is low. I have... I have a lot of nuts. Right? Three peanuts, some raisins for Raisin Boy. Raisin Boy's gonna like that. Hazelnuts. Let me just toss this bloody bandage. I'm trying to think of what to do with all this. So I have sellables. So I can just sell this stuff for money, obviously. Where should I sell it, though? Like, what do I need to buy with money? Bandages, but I can't find any fucking bandages. <laughs> hmm. You know, after... a looting that good... I'm gonna go save. Oh, and I just got an idea. Yes, I have an idea. You know how there's a cache right by here, actually? That we found a while ago? Let me check it, because if there's Schmouter, my god. Also, I need to put this freaking mysterious note back somewhere. Hopefully the kids will forgive me for not putting it back where I found it. No schmouter. Alright. Here you go. Anything else I want to give them? No. Some broken ampules. So when they rummage around in there, they'll cut their little kid fingers. <laughs> that was a dark joke, sorry. I should just try to pawn stuff, so let's go to this closed door. Should I take antibiotics right now? Huff them all. I mean, I guess. I'm really banking on the schmouter. Alright, this is gonna hurt. Should I take more? I kind of want one of each antibiotic left for treating people if I can. <sighs> Let's leave it at that. Bad guy running away. Ooh, that sounds like White Whip. Or Ashen Wisp, is it? Does time pass when I'm trading with people, by the way? Let me test this. 1325. Do, do, do. I'm selling a cloak. It's not worth all that much. Ooh, these rings. They'll pay a lot for that. The charm. Rings are worth a lot. Not so much the charm. I feel rich. 25. No. No time passes. Okay, so I can just chill. <sighs> Leather gloves. I should absolutely buy that. I desperately need clothing. Let's sell those for that. With seven needles, 700 money for seven opened drawers, would that be worth it? Maybe? That's more of a long-term thing, though. I'm thinking short-term right now. I don't need a toolkit at the moment. You have a thimble. Yeah, I don't need any more here. Go 
grocery store? No, I can't sell anything at a grocery store. I can only trade for coupons. Right. My big goal is to be healthy enough to survive the theater, treat people over town, and be strong enough to go here. Basically an impossible task. I really need Schmouter so fucking desperately. But I just don't know where I can go get it. Other than just come across a random kid, and even then I probably won't have the stuff to trade for it, most likely. It's very unlikely, even with the amount of nuts I have. I should probably go around and just start to treat some people then, and just hope I come across Schmouter. I mean, what else can I do? I need bandages, I need Schmouter. I especially need Schmouter. Let's just go treat people. Where should I go to treat people? Yulia, I suppose? Yeah. That would be good. Let's go. It's a lot of fighting going on. How's my knife? Uh, it's half hurt, not bad. Do I see an opportunity here? I'm so stab happy, aren't I? I'm not sure if I can eat either of these without wasting it. I think I should wait for my hunger to go up a bit more. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, buddy. funny thing is I could have looted them. I realized right before I stabbed them, or like right after I stabbed them, that the loot them menu appeared because they had their hands up. <laughs> I should have just done that. I just want their loot. I don't need their body parts or anything. Too late for that, though. I could trade my lockpick for nothing. Trades for four, none of those trade for four. Yeah, I don't want to go this way because I don't want to walk through all of this infected zone for no good reason. Let's go here, here, and then walk through here. So it's a short walk to Yulia's. That seems like a good idea. Do you love your mother? Do you Shh. That is an enemy. And they have turned my way. <laughs> no. I'm glad I saved it after I got all that good loot. Yes. The next thing I'm taking from you is hope. Simple as that. I wonder how you intend to do that. You'll see. An old trick. Don't think of a polar bear. Wounding me with a word, like a splinter, so my mind would see confirmations everywhere. I need to work you loose. That's the whole point of the method. Simon's victory over death had nothing to do with him living past 211. He overcame death by accepting it and then dying. He didn't die, though. He dissolved into many living people. Getting closer to ritual cannibalism, I see. Come now, don't take it so literally. Then again, so long as you equate a person with a body, cannibalism would remain your only way to overcome death. Absurd. False. Are you sure you're a director? You sound like a priest. Alright, back here, sold stuff at the clothes store, dropped off the mysterious note. Back to heading to Yulia's. At this point, I think I can like very confidently say I should not get into combat unless it's 
absolutely necessary. If when I'm on low health anyway. So that person who's approaching once again, I will avoid them. And sneaking isn't super effective, or not at least not nearly as effective as it is at nighttime, which makes sense, of course. Let's go over here. There's a lot of bad people out right now. I think that's another one. Maybe it's not. That might not be. I can't tell. Yeah, I don't think it is. No, 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 no. They're cool. Oh no, that's a, that's a bad person approaching over down this alleyway. Anyway, I just wanted to check something. The kids' boxes might have schmouter in them. I remember one had a box, so maybe I should be checking all the caches. Um, where am I? Up by Yulia's place, right? Well, I don't have anything marked up here. Doesn't mean there isn't anything, but... Don't know if it's worth looking. I guess. I suppose it is. Oh, yes. No matter. But there's a lost note. Guys, he needs a way to remove blood stains. If you know one, leave a note. What are you kids up to? Okay, got a mark down. This time let's not forget to put the note back. Got a fight. Give me your shit. Give me your shit. Give me your shit. Oop. Jesus Christ. Sorry. Jump scare. <laughs> Alright, we're almost to Yulia's. As soon as they start to run away, they go after him again. Make up your mind. I'm desperately looking for children to trade with. Alright, just straight ahead for Yulia. My immunity is very good. Let's avoid that. Tends to be a good amount of bloody bandages found and in things, uh, in trash cans and infected zones. So good to check them. Good for the dead item shop. Prophylaxis. Let's give you something good, Yulia. Let's give you Yas Plus. There you go. You'll be fine. Probably. Let's get the hell out of this district. Looking for bandages. Looking for... Schmouter, as always. Do I want to treat Katarina while I'm here? They're low priority, but... I don't have many antibiotics. I have one of each type, and they're not even good versions of each type. I shouldn't waste it on Katarina. I feel for them, but they're not the most important. Is that a child? Have I reached the land of children? Your water bottle person. I don't know if I have the water bottles, though. Time has become denser somehow. Can you feel it? 
Wait, are you serious? Is that something that changed from me dying so much? Does time go by faster? If so, then fuck me. Yes, it's like it moves faster now. You've noticed it too? It's that Inquisitor woman. She made herself a nest in the cathedral and here's the result. That's why time runs faster now. And it's denser. Why? You can tell. But where does time come from? The cathedral makes it. That's why it's always been empty. No need to crowd the place. Time can only move on freely when it's empty. And she's sitting there like a spider. Must have broken something. If she's broken something, it would have been on purpose, believe me. I have tons of empty bottles, but I need to actually fill them up. Antibiotics are good. Package, I mean... That's good. Candle stub. What can I get for a candle stub? Nothing. Do I want to trade away some red thread? Hmm. No, I don't think I do. Damn. Maybe I do have something to trade. Fishing hooks for two? Huh. <sighs> Pharmacy. But let me just check these people real fast. Hazelnuts for two for a spring. That's fantastic. You know, I don't even have a match, actually. Let's trade a candle stub because it's big for hazelnuts and a match. And uh, actually, they have more hazelnuts. Thanks. Kid, do you have any schmouter? I think I'd say I should save my nuts, actually. For Schmouter. Because it's not like food is a problem right now. Not at all. Okay. Pharmacy. Please have nothing. Thank you for having nothing. Oh wait, sorry, you have a tourniquet. That's something. Do I have anything they care about that I want to give? Nah. I think I should probably buy this gauze mask. I mean, I need freaking clothes, right? My the speed at which my infection or my immunity goes down is just absurd. And if I want to finish my rounds today, I need that. And this is the good stuff too. It's not that random piece of fabric. It's actually a piece of gauze, which is something, I guess. Should I buy some antibiotics for treating people? Maybe even for treating myself? Yeah, sure. Hey, I have a couple hit points. Woohoo! Where did the antibiotics go? Here they are. Oh, they look so different. They're such big pills. Red thread for a charm? Hmm, no. Peter Stamaton. Let's go treat them, and it's a place to save. How fast does time move now? I'm worried. Is that Clara up there? Is that fucking Clara? No, it's just some kid. Whew. 
Sorry, kid. Bunch of kids. Yes. Any of y'all have the good stuff? Nope. They just have the bad stuff. I think anybody who wears a skirt that I see on the street, I'm like, is that Clara? The fucking Clara. Hmm, I can check on Grace while I'm here too. Although I think I already talked with him, technically today, like slightly past midnight. Plus. Either bones or nerves. So, given the fact that I gave them a plus, in my experience, that means it mm, it would have identified this as the problem if it was the problem. So, I'm going to say it's bones. I wish I had plus antibiotics for you, Peter. All right, not bad. sorry. Things are getting too scarce for me to really give treatment to people. Unless they're really, really important to me. Yeah. Yeah. That's just how it is. There's a pharmacy down here. And also, this place marked here used to be clean water. Plus, this is really close to my base, so there's... I fixed that again, didn't I? The pump? So there's some more clean water there, I think. Maybe it'd be good to go there and brew some stuff. Hmm. Let's go to my father's house, because maybe, um... Maybe Foreman Oyun has already moved in. In which case, maybe we can speak with him? 